The Australian tax system works by charging a higher rate of tax to people who earn more. The Australian Tax Office, or ATO, is responsible for ensuring individuals and companies lodge their tax return each year. Each person lodges their own tax return with the ATO for the year ending June 30th. You can lodge your tax return through a registered tax agent or by going online. Individuals and sole traders pay more income tax as they earn more. The amount of tax you pay is based on your taxable income. Taxable income is calculated by subtracting allowable tax deductions from your assessable income. For example, Jenny earns $100,000 in assessable income, which includes her salary and some bank interest from her savings account. She has $20,000 in tax deductions this year, so Jenny's taxable income is $80,000. Frank earns $60,000 in assessable income and has $5,000 in allowable tax deductions. His taxable income, therefore, is $55,000. Frank would pay less income tax than Jenny because his taxable income is lower. Companies pay tax at a flat rate and can also claim tax deductions. For example, construction company Proprietary Limited earns $2 million in profit this year. It must pay tax at a flat rate of 30%. If the company's profits fall to $1 million next year, it will still pay 30% in tax on all of its profits. This is different to individuals who pay a greater percentage of tax the more they earn. Another type of tax many people have is capital gains tax. Capital gains tax is paid on long-term investments or assets which are sold at a profit. For example, Frank buys some shares for $5,000 and sells them for $7,000 in two months. He makes a $2,000 capital gain. This $2,000 gain is added to his yearly tax bill. For most Australians, capital gains is not paid on the family home. The Medicare levy is also paid by Australian residents. In addition to the levy, people who have private health insurance for the entire tax year may be able to avoid paying another tax known as the Medicare levy surcharge. The Australian tax system can appear complicated since it also includes offsets, levies, and different rates of tax for non-residents, companies, and super funds. Therefore, it may be best to speak to a registered tax agent when you are completing your yearly tax return.